Thanks for joining us. I'm Naomi Kidd. Karen has the night off. First at six, the city of Tulsa and Tulsa Public Schools say they're getting the biggest grant in the city's history to improve mental health in children under 18. Two News Oklahoma's Sam Santamajani has the message from today's press conference and the impact officials hope that $13 million will bring. Altogether, this is the largest amount of competitive federal funding for our children's mental health ever directed to the Tulsa community. Interim TPS Superintendent Dr. Ebony Johnson joined officials Thursday at City Hall, announcing there's now 13 million reasons to celebrate helping Tulsa kids get mental health care. $4 million goes to new resources from the city's Mental Health Commission, working with nonprofits like Healthy Minds Policy Institute. Most of the programming funded by these grants is going to fund services that children lack if they have really intensive needs. So you need something more than a therapist visit once a month, but you don't want to go in and out of the ER or a crisis center. The grants come from the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration to be dispersed over four years. It coincides with the city's active search for its first chief mental health officer. Mayor G.T. Bynum says this comes not a moment too soon. For all of those children who are driving up uh, by a substantial number, uh, the number of uh, those being treated, we also have those who are most in need not getting any treatment at all. $9 million of the grants will go to Tulsa Public Schools over the next five years. Dr. Johnson says this is a breakthrough for the school district, especially for its families who might suffer economically. So it's going to be a, a true set of um, intentional supports for students who um, I would say would not otherwise always have that level of intensity of support. We're going to be able to provide that. Johnson adds the district already wrote up plans before the grants were approved and with the funding TPS families can get results. I would say that it'll be a serious ramp up of supports for our students so um, by you know of course mid-year end of year we should definitely see our students being able to get even more support for their mental health challenges of course with the supports and collaboration with their families. In Tulsa, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma. Tulsa is the only city in the state to get funding from that federal program. An additional $3 million will come from matched donations from community partners for local nonprofits like Healthy Minds.